Honey, I told you I'd find a way back to you again. Now, <clears throat> for about a year now, I've been hearing about this baddest woman on the planet. But the last time I came to your show, I dropped you right there. And even after that, you never came looking for me to prove that you're the baddest. I've come looking for you to prove you're not. And you've heard about this, but last night I won the Royal Rumble match. So I don't need much time to think. I choose you. I want him to be looking me in the eye and primed to fight. I don't just want to beat you. I want to beat the best version of Becky Lynch that has ever existed. You? me and everyone else here knows that I can re-break your face faster than you could say Nia Jax. In fact, you, me, and everyone else here knows that I have the ability to kill you with my bare hands without even breaking a sweat. And the only thing stopping me is my decision not to. You see, Rhonda, winning comes so easily to you that when you finally meet the man, your titanium body will be let down by your weak mind. I have been ground down and spat back up again more times than I can count. I have made history. I have been tested daily, weekly, monthly, and yet here I am, the most relentless person that you have ever met. I want you to bring all of your angst. I want you to bring all of your rage. I want you to bring all of your pent-up resentment. I want you to bring everything that you got because I want a challenge. And I don't care if you're the baddest on the planet because I'm going to make you mine. I am a natural born killer, beaten to a fine edge after years and years of waking up every single morning wanting to be the greatest athlete of all time. But you say, you say I should be happy because I have your respect. Rhonda, you're gonna find out that it's not your respect that I'm coming after, it's your arm. And at WrestleMania, I am going to break your mystique. I am going to take your title. And I am gonna kick your ass in front of the whole world. 